talked it already tonight. Second and nine. Cornelius. Another deep ball. Finds an open receiver again. Taylor Cornelius, if you don't throw a real tight spiral, the wind's going to catch it. And that's why Dylan Mitchell had to come back a little bit to the ball. Four to the right, looking that way. Shorter receiver, Mitchell, dancing around. Trying to make a miss, and he still gets a few extra yards after the catch. The yeah. time is at a premium here, just under a minute to go. Yeah, good field position now for Cornelius, working from the Calvary 50. He'll get it to Mitchell, and Mitchell will push ahead down towards the 40. Under four minutes to go until halftime here in Edmonton. From the Elk, 26, down by 14, deep ball, Cornelius, and it's caught by Dylan Mitchell. Another one of the great newcomers to this Edmonton team as he gets it inside the 20, Mitchell. And sometimes you just got to knife it in there. Nice smooth stroke, about 45 yards, gets it there quickly, and then Dylan Mitchell does the rest. Yeah, it's a busted route, extended play. And Taylor Cornelius finds Dylan Mitchell for a big game. He needed that. And you got to know who's got five for the Calgary Stampeders. Good luck with that. He's, he's playing injured to new, tonight, too, Johnny Pearlberg is. He's, he's doing a great job, as always. Dylan Mitchell with the catch in the first down. Good to see him re, you know, continuing his success from week one. From last week in the Labor Day Classic, in his first, and he he looks like he belongs. He's seen it really clearly. You know, I, I see a lot of talent on that football team, and and you know they're not hitting their stride, although they've won more games. But from the 18, near side, they'll get into the hands of Dylan Mitchell, and Mitchell's going to go up the sideline. Should be enough for a first down against this Riders starting defense. First year elk out of Oregon. Early movement here against that line. They're going to look down the field to Mitchell. Cornelius drops it in down to the 30, to the 20, to the 10, and he'll take it home for a touchdown. Oh, boy. 77 yards, but this one likely coming back, although Cornelius says it's going to count. And Well, he's celebrating, and he was back there talking to the official. Offside schedule number six. Oh, there you wow. go. The he's declined. The result of the play is a touchdown. Some saying that you would think. Here's Cornelius. Pressure coming backside. Gets it away. Mitchell has it. And he has a first down. That's his biggest catch of the ball game. Uh, Takes timely. it out to the 25. Timely, too. Mitre into the left of Cornelius. Second and six. Cornelius on the run. Still going. Near side. He's got a completion. It's Mitchell. And that's a first down as Cornelius gets out on the run and makes a big play. Four receivers to the right for Cornelius. He's going to take a deep shot down the field. And Mitchell fumbles it in. You've got to be kidding me. Yeah, he's trying to fight back. Now if he's lying, got that arm hooked. Steve Mitch comes off of it late, makes a spectacular catch. And Edmonton, decent field position. We'll get it to Mitchell. Mitchell turns. Now he's inside the 30 and eventually taken down. Old sideline calling. Second and 10. Three options to the right for Cornelius. He's going to look down the field for Mitchell. And he's going to haul it in. Mitchell will take it all the way home and Edmonton strikes and has some life and it's into the hands of Dylan Mitchell for 59 yards and his third touchdown of the season. Cornelius far side has a completion to Mitchell. Mitchell turns it upfield. He's got a first down wrapped up on the ankles by Parker. Well, that'll move Edmonton down the field after a 13-yard pickup. He stands in there right now over to the right of Ford. Ford looking, throwing it to the end zone for Mitchell. They strike first, Ford finds Mitchell for his fourth 
touchdown of the season. And both teams want this win badly for very different reasons. But you can't throw it any better on that fade route down in the end zone than Trey Ford does there. Out on the outside shoulder of Dylan Mitchell, where only he has a crack at it. Woo. That left foot inside the white stripe. Great throw and catch. If you lose your last game, the offseason sucks. Home or away. <laughs> Let alone throw the streak aside. Nice little play here. Exactly. To get Mitchell involved. He picks up a first down. Green wore 15. We ran 15. Kilgore was wearing 15 the last time they won a game. Now here's Mitchell. Big completion. First and 10 for the BC 46. Four. Far side. Good throw to Mitchell. And he's able to haul it in.